nice fat trout. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning to you, sir. Mr. Trout. Glad y'all are with me today. I've been waiting for the water to kind of clear up after the tropical storm Debbie that came through and uh, trying to find some decent looking water. And that's my first fish of the day. I'm out here in the Medway River on the Georgia coast. And that was my first fish of the morning. It's my second stop. So, but that was a nice fat fish. I was surprised. They said, the guys I was talking to at the marina said that um, I needed to find water that wasn't red looking. And really this is a little bit red looking, but I saw this bait. This is a spot that I fish pretty frequently. And uh, if I ever see bait here, I usually catch fish. So I felt like I needed to try it out. My hook broke off. Or my line broke. My hook didn't break, my line broke. When I pay attention, they don't bite. Actually, my shrimp's gone. So, they do bite. They take my shrimp. And I don't even know it. Even though I was paying attention that time. I really was. Really watching. I was really watching. Nice jack. Jacks aren't good to eat or anything, but they're fun to catch. They really fight hard. A lot, a lot, a lot, a lot of bait in here. The tide's just now turning around, kind of. Trout this time. Little trouts. Okay, I think I might have figured something out here. I think I might have figured something out. Dang, guys. Ooh. Oh, am I missing these fish? Thank you. 
they're back there. That shrimp escaped. I mean, I don't want to say that I got outsmarted by shrimp, but he's in the river and I'm right here. I'd say we got a school of fish. Skinny. Long and lean. Pretty fish. I had this big, huge knot in my line. See it? And I was sitting there messing with it. And Mr. Jack decided he needed to come along. That thing wasn't out there 10 feet. Well, this pole was out of commission for now. You have to fix that at home. But you know what? I got another one. Matter of fact, I got two more. <laughs> Always be prepared. I mean, I wasn't a Boy Scout, but. I went to elementary school with some guys that knew some other guys that uh, may have been in the Boy Scouts. I'm not sure, but I am prepared. Well, setting the woods on fire but catching a few trout yellow mouth I'll try this uh, lighter float see if it helps me out sometimes it helps to have that Water float on there. Well, Helped that time on that fish. Come on, be still. You're acting. This trout's behavior. I'm, I want to apologize for this this trout's behavior. I used to have to do that a lot. Like when I went to a restaurant, I'd have to apologize for my, my children when they were little. So uh, <clears throat> I apologize for that trout's behavior. That's not the way he was taught. That trout was taught a lot better. Taught to act a lot better. It really was. Really was.
Well, I guess this little light float was the ticket. As far as hooking fish, I think when you get that bigger float, sometimes these little fish especially, or the smart fish, can uh, feel it when they eat that shrimp. They feel the resistance of that float and that weight that's there and maybe they let it go, I don't know. But that's two for two. This is a half ounce. And that other one was an ounce. Which means the float weighs an ounce and the weight weighs an ounce. Two for two for the lightweight. <laughs> three. three for three. This may be a ladyfish. Not sure. It's acting wacky. Way them ladyfish act wacky. No, it's just a wacky little trout. Look at that This would be called getting on a little school of trout. That's what you would call this right now. Or you could call it a circus or a clown show, a goat roping. Whatever you want to call it, I call it getting on a school of trout. Must be a million trout out there in that spot. Just cover it up with them. I mean, I just throw out there. I don't have to wait. Don't have to do anything special. Just catch a fish. I had the intention of going to a new place today, but I just hate to run out a bunch of gas running all over the place when I could sit right here and catch fish. Little. Okay, I'll tell you something else about this little lighter one float here too is uh, when I tied this one it had a longer leader than that other float and apparently that makes a big difference too see this leader is from there all the way to here so sometimes they would they Want that longer leader for whatever reason. You'd think it wouldn't matter if it's live shrimp. I mean, you got the same bait.
Another skinny trout. hitting it hard I mean, they're just killing it and they hit it Today. I wanted to run around and explore a little bit, but if I, I mean, if I stop in a spot and I'm catching fish like crazy and I'm just going to keep catching fish, I'm going to catch a, I'm sorry. I, why am I apologizing for catching fish? I don't know. I don't know anybody any. I'm sorry for catching. I'm never going to be sorry for catching fish. So, thanks for watching, guys. I appreciate y'all. Hope you had a good time. Hope you get to go fishing soon. And uh, thanks for watching Nichols Retirement Empire.